Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing makeup on this lovely beautiful girl. Her name is Kia Renee and I will be recording the whole thing today. These are previous pictures from last time I did her makeup. Don't so mind the scarf guys, my hair is wrapped. I'll be cute when this is over. Wait, wait till, till I get dressed. I'm telling you. She about to get this face together and I'll be... They gonna see a transformation real quick. Transformation. <laughs> Don't take my scarf off. <laughs> hey y'all. I was telling my. Can I hear a song? Yeah. <laughs> it was for real. Kira Renee here, guys, from the Sexy TV Show host. Hello. Yeah. So the first thing I will be doing, I will be doing her eyebrows. I'm using the spike pencil from Mac, and I am now blending out the front of them because I like to make them look a little cleaner. Cleaner. And sharper at the end. Now I'll be cleaning it up with some concealer. I'm using NW35 in the pot. I'm cleaning them up all around. I like the way her eyebrows are shaped. They're beautiful. Now I'm blending it out with an elf brush from Target. Cost of two bucks. Now I'm using the Urban Decay Eyelid Primer. And I'm using Blush Cosmetics Eyeshadow. This one is in number 88 brick and then I use a little number um, 25 in the brown that she has and now I am using on her lids the makeup pa makeup naked palette. I am using Sin. I put a little teardrop in the front of her eye. So now I'm putting on a primer for her. These are DW lashes. I am going to be putting these on her. I make sure I put the primer on her so that it can dry while I'm putting on her lashes. I'm using um, the mascara to make sure all her lashes are sticking up before I place the lashes on her. And I love for my clients to look at their face the whole time I'm doing their makeup so they can tell me if they don't like something or if they want me to move something or clean something up. It works for me better. Now I'm using um, foundation. I'm using NW45 mixed with uh, Makeup Forever number 173. I mix those together and put those on her face. The concealer that I'm using now is in NW25 as a concealer. And I'm using Benai Banana Powder to cover up the concealer to brighten that up. That's what we use the powder for to brighten up those spots. Miss Kia is a very light-skinned girl, but you can make her either too light or too dark really quickly. So I make sure I try to match her face. <laughs> she is hilarious, you guys. So you let that sit on her face for at least three minutes, and that's what I'm doing while I'm putting on her on her lipstick. Right now, I am using the lip liner pencil in Ruby Woo, and then now I am going in with. Uh, Kat Von D lipstick and what is this? Studded Kisses. Oh, I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it on here. I can't remember what lipstick shade it is. So now I was just dusting off all the powder for her highlight, and I'm using now a contour stick at number nine from Mac to contour her face. She doesn't like too much of a contour, so she's going to ask me to take it down just a tad bit, and I'll be doing that right after I enter her blush. So, right now, I'm putting on her highlight. She likes the highlight. She said, I have, she said, I have a red lipstick, and it might get on my teeth. We laughed about it. Make sure, if you're wearing top lashes, that you put on some bottom lashes, girl. Do not forget those bottom lashes, okay? So now, I am just lining over the lipstick to make sure her lips is perfect because you don't want to be too much eyeliner. This is the hardest step to me. I hate messing up people's lips. And then the end result after I sprayed her, this is how she looked. And this is a few pictures from after when we went into a better lighting for you guys to see. I took a couple of pictures so you guys can see how it looks on her from a distance. I love the way it turned out and that is her natural hair. She looks so classy and elegant and I really do appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you for tuning in and we will see you next time.
As you can see the shimmer on her eye and the boldness of the red lip, we were doing a popping lip and a simple eye. She was going to an event she had to host and I think she looked it very, very beautiful. This was the event for the kids and she looked like she's spunky and ready to have a good time. I love the look and she styled herself. Thank you guys for watching. Toodles! Bye!